There you go. Now you can hear. My bad. Well, I forgot why I switched this scene and disabled it. But yeah, we're just going to do some pool, and I'm going to try to find some music to listen to. Um, so let me... Let me look through my playlists here and see if I can put something together real fast that doesn't have things that's going to get me copyright striked to high heaven. Um, it's I need I I should have done this sooner because I didn't have. You know what? I'm gonna be lazy. I'm gonna go use the vine uh vine sauce music playlist because I can't be bothered to set one up right now. Um, and then I will uh. And then after, uh, and then once next time I do this, I'll have something better set up for it. So let's just shuffle play on this and keep it nice and low. How's that? That's probably too low. No, that's fine. That'd be good. That's, all right. So the, yeah, this is. I'm just cheating and using that music playlist that Vinny uses during his art streams. But uh, let's see here. Nine ball time. Oh yeah, this game has wonderful pictures of random people for what we play against, and it's really wonderful. They're really scummy, and it's it's great. Oh, tournament? Yeah, let's just do that. All right. But I put my own pool. I put my own pool art in up here because <laughs> I've got artwork of my character playing pool because I I love pool. Ah. Oh. But yeah, I'll probably only do this for about 30, 40 minutes, and then uh, that'll probably be about time for Trek anyways, so. Let's see, where do I want to put this? This is such a shitty spot. Oh, I sunk something. Dang it, I actually didn't want to there. Okay, well, that works, I guess. It's not what I... Look at this, look at this scummy guy. Look at this guy. <laughs> I love the portraits of this game. They're so dumb. <laughs> they're just, they're, they're just part of the game, Moon. Like, and it's funny because this is Virtual Pool 4. And when I was a kid, I played Virtual Pool 3, which came out in the 90s. And they have the same portraits. They've literally never changed them. Let's see if I can... Oh, I was trying to get the seven in there, but I didn't get the angle right. Yeah, I know they're wonderful. Like, there's also really bad '90s FMV cutscenes in this. Oh, he's just gonna sink two balls. Okay. Um. So yeah, this <laughs> this game has a lot of character. <laughs> yeah, that was a fucking shot. The AI is when it wants to be, it can be merciless, and other times it just derps. And that was a terrible shot put the wrong type of spin on it. Ugh. This would be something I'd be down to play with viewers, too, if anybody has this game. Um, maybe not tonight, but in the future. Uh, this is super chill, and uh, yeah, this is a lot of fun to... Like, well, it's pool. Well, what more is there to be said? This eight ball is trapped against the uh, trapped against the wall here. Let's see if we can free it. All right, I was aiming for the side pocket, but now he's he's probably gonna win here. He's got an easy shot in the eight ball. I mean, that's kind of how I am in pool two, squirrel. I've played pool since I was a kid, but. Uh, but my, I'm very inconsistent, and I, let, I can't run tables as a result. Um, back when I was playing it almost every day... What the heck was that shot? Um, back when I was playing it almost every day... Because um, my, my grandparents owned a pool table. This guy is just going to clear the table now, so we're just going to watch that happen. Um, but yeah, my grandparents owned a pool table, and I used to play it almost every day when I was up there. Uh... Back when I was doing that, I was pretty good at it, but I've I've lost the skill. Uh, this game does a pretty good job of simulating it, though, which I like. Oh, you ran a bar with some tables? That's awesome. I've always wanted to... Oh, that was... 
That was a terrible shot. Also, I love how this table in this particular locale... So there's a bu this game has a bunch of different locales and tables. I love how this locale's table is all scummy and gross. <laughs> I've played on some tables that look like this. <laughs> Oh, he's going to miss that. Uh, I guess I can just easily take... Well, not easily. This is actually a little bit of a tricky shot, but... There we go. Not too bad. Oh. I never put enough angle on it when I'm trying to bounce balls off the wall like that. But he's in a really shitty sp Oh, nice shot. <laughs> Let's see here. Can we do anything fun here? We might build it. Yeah, I think we're going to do, do this here. Watch this. Okay, but now I kind of ruined my... I was hoping the one ball would stop up there, and now I kind of screwed myself. <laughs> Hold on. We got this. Not bad. He's gonna make the one, but he missed the one. Wow. Oh, oh, stop, stop, stop. Ugh. 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 What a awful spot. Now, if I remembered how to curve the ball, this would be a spot where you could maybe curve it, but I'm, I don't remember how to do that. It's been years since I've done anything fancy like that. Might be able to do a bank shot here, though. Yeah, I, I, I used to know how to do it IRL. Like, that's where I learned, and I haven't done it in years. I'm trying to think of how I want to angle this. I think like this. Oh, that was so close. Oh, he's just gonna win. Okay, cool. Alright, I'll take that scratch though. I also ha I also bu uh, set up my pool stick in this game. You can't see it very well at this angle, but this pool stick is very similar to one I actually owned in uh, in real life. <laughs> Although I think all the sticks in this game are actually real sticks, so it's not surprising. Ah, Balam Garden. Good song. Wait, low ball not hit for. Oh, the one is still up. What am I doing? <laughs> I didn't even see it. <laughs> what I've been playing a lot of in this actually lately has been snooker. This this uh, this does have snooker in it, and that's a lot of fun. I'm really bad at it, but it's really fun. Never played snooker in real life though. Pretty hard to find a table in the U.S. I've never looked, but there probably is, like, snooker tables in the area where I live. They are massive, yeah. Like, even, I mean, a tournament-sized pool table is no small thing, but snooker's even bigger than that. Ah. Uh, oh, well. Yeah, I might have snookered him a little bit, though. Doesn't have the greatest shot. Yeah, that's what I thought. Uh, can I sink this right now? Nah, we'll go this way. Okay, that didn't roll the way I... I wanted it to go behind the nine ball and not come back this way, but okay. Oh. Almost had the angle where I wanted it, but... Oh, well. I want, I, now, now it makes me wonder, though. Now I want to Google to see if there's any, any places to play snooker near me. Because now that I live near a big city versus where I grew up, which was in the middle of nowhere, I probably could find one if I really wanted to. It'd be a lot of fun to learn to play it in real life. I wonder if I can get the 9. Let's see. If I do something like this. Nope. Oh, wait. 
Nope. Okay. I was trying to get it along the rail into that corner pocket, but... <sighs> what a crappy shot. Try... Actually, hold on, hold on, hold on. Ah, almost. <laughs> oh, nice miss. I love when the AI just hands you the game. Got them both. <laughs> Ooh, I might get the nine. I did. Nice. Good way to win that. Okay, that photo's not as scummy, at least. That looks like a real person, at least. I mean, the other one was a real person, too, but, like... <laughs> I mean, I can just take this game home right now, actually. Nope. Not if I shoot like that, I can't. I don't even know what song this is. Never heard this before. Oh, my turn. To wait for a sec. <laughs> That'll work. over there. Perfect. I need to come back after this shot, so we're gonna like that. And that didn't go where I wanted it. I should have actually put top spin on it. Uh, I don't think we're gonna make this shot, so we're just gonna try to position it somewhere where it's gonna be harder for him to hit it. Or her, I guess, technically, based on the portrait. Oh, nope. Whoops. <laughs> that was exactly the opposite of what I wanted to do. I wonder if I could do something like this. Okay. Close. I, if I hit it a little bit harder, I would have came back and hit the eight ball in, probably. Here. Nice. Clean. Oh, I just... We're gonna have to do a push out here. Yeah, the thing I like about Snooker uh, versus, you know, like 9-ball or 8-ball or something is I love how much strategy goes into Snooker. Um, I'm not, again, I'm not good at it, but I, I like the, the concept of it. Perfect. And then we need this to stop as soon as I... 
Uh, too close to three, but I can maybe make something work here. Yeah. There we go. Yeah, exactly, Squirrel. Yeah. Um, I actually, a lot of people, are, it, it, I, a lot of people I tell this to do, don't believe me when I tell them this, but when I was a kid, uh, I actually would watch Snooker on TV. There was like a, so one of the cable channels we got uh, had it, had Snooker uh, tournaments on TV, and I would, I loved watching that. I didn't understand a, anything that was happening in the game when I was a kid, but once I learned, how, you know, some of the rules and stuff, it was really interesting. So yeah, it's something on my bucket list of something I'd like to try and learn to do in real life. Oh, didn't put enough on it. It might come back. Nope. All right. No, you're absolutely right, Moon. It, uh, pool was just, in general, bigger in the, like, 80s and 70s and 80s. Think Pool d has kind of died off alongside things like arcades, which makes me really sad, because I love this shit. Yeah, it's true, too, Squirrel. There weren't even movies about it. I need to look up some of good some good pool movies to watch. I don't, I don't think I've watched any. Let's see, can I get... Something like this might work. Well, it's not an easy shot. Uh, it might be an easy shot for her. Yeah, there was a whole kind of, like, pool culture in the U.S. back in the 80s and maybe even late 70s. Um, before my time, I was born in 85, so... But I've always been kind of a... I've always been kind of an old soul, like... I've always liked things that were a little bit before my time. Oops, crud. I remember going to pool halls as a kid with my parents, and we'd play pool, and it was re it was really fun. Oh, okay. Just whack that ball around the table. A really boring Saturday in the 80s, you're watching televised bowling. Oh my god, yeah, no, I've definitely seen that too. Get in there. Ugh. Oh, okay. <laughs> this is like this is like when I play pool in real life with with friends. Like neither of us can secure the game. Okay, don't don't follow it in. I've actually been thinking about looking up like old pool and snooker tournaments and seeing if they're they're like archived on YouTube or archive.org or anything. The stuff that I watched as a kid, just because I, I just want to see if it's out there. I'm sure someone recorded it on VHS and has archived it. I mean, it's got to be out there, right? <laughs> there we go. That was a good shot. Exactly. like Just like old-timey, but with like pool and bowling and Darts or something. I don't know what else was of <laughs> would have been in that that category, but oh, I came back too far. I meant to stop it on the rail. Oh well, might be able to do one of these. Nope, I hit the edge of the pocket there. I wanted to hit the eight ball in. VHS archive most likely has it. Okay, I'll have to keep an eye on it. Yeah. If nothing else, there'd be, there might be really cool, like, instructional videos out there, which would be fun to check out someday. No, 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 don't go in the pocket. Okay. Where do I need to be after this shot? I actually need to go... Yeah, kind of... Extreme stretching exercise from 1989. That's awesome. I always... It, it, you say it like that, it makes me think of... Uh, 
Oh. What was that thing in the 90s that was kind of big for a while? Taibo. Remember, anyone remember that? Oh my god. Is that even still around? Just remember the VHS tapes of that stuff. Oh, wow, I missed that. Oops. The 80s had a lot of really weird uh, weird fads. Billy Blanks Jr. follows you on TikTok. Is that the guy from Tybo? Is that, like, the Tybo guy? <laughs> I don't know his name, so... His son? Okay. <laughs> That's funny. Okay, slow down, slow down, slow down. Okay, good. We're gonna put some backspin on the cue ball here. Try to, yeah, just like that. Now I should be able to just go. Oh, too much spin. I needed to hit it a little bit more to the right. Oh well, I tried. This person's name is Leather Lena, by the way. What a name. Oh, also, all of these characters in this game have backstories that you can read. I don't know why they have backstories or why that was required, but they do. <laughs> I'll take that. Oh, gosh. I'm so bad at those types of banks. But, snookered her. It really is hilarious. I'll show you, I'll show some of that off after this, uh, after I finish these matches. I also, like, so when I first started playing this game again, like, all the, like, scummy characters and weird backstories and stuff. It reminds me of, like, something that Vinny would have played on Sunday Stream, and I, uh... I had this, like, false memory of Vinny having played this exact game on Sunday Stream, but it never happened. I checked all the archives, and as far as I can tell, that never happened. So it's just, like, a f weird false memory. Ugh. Maybe it was Joel. Maybe this, song, th this would have been, like, a Joel thing. Maybe that's where I saw it. Yeah, it, that's exactly, yeah. It is kind of more of J up Joel's alley than Vinny's. Although Vinny would probably enjoy it. But, yeah. Come on, get in there. Almost got both of them. <laughs> oh, I hate shots. Ah, oh, close. Should be on the rail, though, so it'll make it pretty tough for her. Didn't we listen to this song already? Yeah, we did. Let's skip this one. Why is it playing the same ones over and over again? We listened to this one, too. Is YouTube shuffle broken? What the heck? It's playing the same songs over and over. Literally the same two songs. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, let's try this again. Shuffle playlist. Can you... Shuffle play. Give me a different two songs. Okay, this is Animal Crossing. We'll take this. I don't understand how Shuffle can be so bad on YouTube sometimes, like... Sometimes it works perfectly. Alright, so we won that. Um, but yeah, let me let me show you some of this, like... So, like, like for example, this guy's the boss of this uh, area. And they, look at this, he has, like, a whole, like, little backstory written here. And they all have this. All of these guys. <laughs> like, why? Why do they all have little, little bios written? And there's so many of them.
I love it. Look at this guy. <laughs> yeah, low tech. My favorite is, uh, I haven't seen him in a while, but there's one that's literally just a cat. That one's my favorite. Um, let's play this guy. In a little bit nicer table too in this in this venue. Oh my god. Oh wait, this is this is a different song from the same game. Okay. I thought it was going back to that same song. I appreciate that uh, there's different venues with different tables, and uh, like the ball, even the balls look different on the different tables. I, I appreciate that in this game. Little details like that. I wish there was a modding scene for this game that had like a bunch of different venues and stuff to download, but there really isn't. Yeah, no, it's definitely like the dev team and their families. Like that's entirely what all these pictures are, and it's hilarious. Ooh, that was kind of a bad shot. <laughs> the, the, my favorite thing, though, is that these pictures were the same ones from the 1990s version of this game. They just, they never bothered to update them. Get in there. There you go. Oh, yeah, in the 90s, like in the credits books, that, yeah, that was always fun. I don't even know what I hit. This camera didn't zoom out enough. Guess it was the seven. Uh, while I'm watching this guy play, let me see. It should be almost trek time, and then we'll send a raid over there once it is. I'm only going to play this for a little bit. Oh, okay. Guess it's my turn. This is kind of a crappy table right now. I almost want to put my, the cue ball behind here and go hit that six ball out, but it's not really smart. I don't know. I'm just going to backspin out, out of here, I think. That wasn't enough backspin. Can I get the six? Oh, wow. Okay. <laughs> Just barely. Yeah, if you like pool, I highly recommend this game. Solaris uh, has has made virtual pool for years, and it's always been a good product. Um, and like I said, I'd be down to play this with viewers uh, eventually. Some you know, sometime if people pick it up or whatever. Uh, it's it's chill. Come on, get down there. Oh no, cue ball. Ah. <laughs> um. It does have a little bit of a learning curve to it, because it has a lot of, like, weird key bindings and stuff, but it think of it like a simulator rather than a video game. I mean, it is a video game, but it it is kind of on the simulator side of video game versus, you know, arcade -y style. Yeah, I honestly didn't even know, Moon, that Solaris had made a Virtual Pool 4, because I played three years ago, like I said, and... One day on, I was bored and looking on Steam, I'm like, what is there for pool games out there? And I'm like, oh, Virtual Pool 4 is a thing. Well, hell, I'm going to buy that. That's how this started. Oh, I didn't. No. Uh, I'm sure there's other good ones out there, too. Uh, actually, if you play in VR, um, I can recommend uh, Sports Bar VR is a pretty decent VR pool. Um... Sonic Mania, huh? Okay. Sure. Listen to Sonic Mania. Sonic music is honestly kind of fitting to pool. It's very 80s. Oh, yeah. Leaning on the table? No, I almost fell... I almost fell off my... I almost fell doing that the first night I played Virtual Pool. I... I... My brain was like, yeah, you can just lean on the table, and nope, it's not really there. <laughs> I almost want to, like, put a, 
artificial table in my VR space for when I play that, just so I can kind of lean over it. Ooh, that was a scary shot. This Sonic music is oddly fitting, and I like it. Alright, let's see here. Oh, nope, that was wrong. <laughs> the thing you could hang on your shoulder to brace your hand. You talk... I'm trying to picture what you're talking about. That sounds interesting, though. See, that would be me with a 3D printer. All I would print would be, like, dumb little models of, like... Like, I'd print a little Ori or like a little model of my character or something. Because, I mean, obviously I have a 3D model of a character. You're seeing it on screen. You know, I'd print dumb stuff like that rather than, like, anything useful. <laughs> ah. Dang it. Not enough angle again. Looped around your shoulder and there's a little platform hung on the end. Oh, that... Okay, that's really smart, actually. That, w that would be a really cool way to do that. See, I would just be lazy and put a table in my VR space, and then I would trip over it. Oh! Almost had the five. Okay. Whoa, lot too much backspin. <laughs> Ooh, I don't like that. Am I touching the eight? No, but I might as well be. That's good. Just take that. Use a chair and it became a dick dance. Forgetting I could just move my VR character instead of physically walking and moving the chair. <laughs> yep, that sounds like something that would happen to me too. Oh, hey Rico, how's it going? We're not playing snooker tonight. We are uh, playing just nine ball. Uh, just chilling to wrap up the stream with this. <laughs> I mean, I could play a couple rounds of snooker if there's time. Snookless in Seattle. <laughs> How you doing tonight, Rico? Oh yeah, my artwork. You like that? <laughs> I got that picture commissioned years ago. I figured this was a good use of it. Yeah, but this is an eight ball, so I don't... No, it's it's not bad. If you sink the money ball on break, it's usually a victory. Um, the money ball in this one's the nine ball, though. Oh no, what is this? So Moon, that highly depends on which version of 8-Ball you're playing, and there are a million different varieties. Let's see if I remember how to... God, if I could curve... Again, if I could curve the ball here. If I do like... It's something like doing like this, and... But like, I don't remember exactly how to do it. Nope, that's not how you do it. <laughs> Hitting it from the top, maybe, too. Yeah, there's a way to do it. Like, I know the top strategy, but that's not, like, the proper strategy. <laughs> but, yeah, I, I... Yeah, I'm not good at it. Oh, oh almost. 
What is this song? I, there's just a bunch of anime girls on my YouTube, second monitor with, from YouTube. I don't know what this game is. It's perpendicular tape. Yeah, not the top top. And, and you want you got to be careful too because like if you if you do it the wrong way. Yeah, exactly, Squirrel. Yeah, if you do it the wrong way, you just look like a jackass, and then you put your cue through the felt, and then people get really mad at you. And Massé is exactly the term I was looking for. I couldn't remember what that was called. Nope. Crap. Oh, it didn't go in. Okay. Take that. Oh, yeah, it makes a very distinctive noise, and you're just like, oh, God. The funny thing is, I'll, 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 I'll try a shot with, like, that at some point here. And, uh, <laughs> at some point here, I'll, I'll try a shot like that, and it's going to make you cringe, because they actually replicate the sound. Like, they probably recorded someone doing it to get the sound for this game, and it's really accurate. Oh, God. Here's a good time to try it. Because I'm not going to make this shot anyways, so... Let's see. Uh, put that up there. And we'll do something like this, and we're going to... Uh, we're going to totally fuck it up, so it's not going to go anywhere. Yep, perfect. But there's that sound. What other sound, Rico? <laughs> oh, of clipping the ball with the stick? Yeah, that's in here, too. Also a good noise. This guy just gonna take the whole table. Oh, a miscue? Yeah, yeah, that's the word. That, that sound is also in here. <laughs> yeah, thwack. <laughs> it's the saddest little whick sound. Oh, uh, it's an AI, Rico. I'm not online or anything. The AI in this game has wonderfully scummy uh, portraits. Uh, we were talking about earlier how they all have really bad portraits and really, uh, and, and they all have like really dumb backstories and names. It's really funny. <laughs> Chalk is free. <laughs> yep. I, that's the one thing this game doesn't simulate that I kind of wish it did was, like, having to actually re-chalk your stick. Like, it's the, it would be the dumbest thing to simulate in a video game, but I'm a nerd, and I'd be like, yeah, make me chalk the stick. <laughs> oil in Witcher? I never played Witcher. What, what was the deal with the oil? apply oil to do decent def DPS for different enemies. Felt like, yeah, okay, yeah, something you could forget and it would ruin your shot. Yeah, no, that's that's pretty good. I need to play Witcher one of these days. Let's see. Ah. Oh, I might actually, oh, I almost got the 9 off that. Would have been a good shot. You can do jump shots in this, too. Uh, again, I, I know, I used to know how to do them, but... Every time I've tried it, I've messed it up, so... Oh, he just cleaned house. So this is usually about the time where the AI just starts running away with games on me, and just cl clearing the entire table. Yeah, I, I think it needs to go on my bucket list. Especially since I played through, I, or I haven't finished it yet, but I played a, I played a little bit of Cyberpunk, uh, probably about half of the story, and ignoring all the bugs and all that other nonsense, um, I actually really enjoyed the design, the, like the, the the quest design and stuff. 
So if I enjoyed Cyberpunk, I think I would enjoy The Witcher, because it's a better game. Let's see if I can bank this. Okay, that works. Ooh, look at this. I might even... Uh, I think he has a shot on it. No, he doesn't. Ha! Well, he got a hit, though. Alright. And I saw your comment earlier, too, Squirrel, about the AI playing defense. One thing I do like about this game is, th is the AI does have different, like, play styles, and they will play defense sometimes. Uh, don't go in there. Okay, that was bad, but... Exactly, Squirrel. I love... That, that That is exactly what I enjoyed. I enjoyed the driving, too. Everybody complains about the driving in Cyberpunk, but, like, just plug in a controller, and then it's... Then it's really fun. Oh, thanks for the game, dude. Okay, so, um, Snooker. Let me do double check, though, before we get too far into another game. Okay, still no trek time, so we'll keep playing for a bit. Uh, we'll do some. Do some snooker. I have a snooker career. Not very good at it, so I'm not as far along. Uh, tournament. Yeah, sure. See, snooker's weird. Like, one the the strategy in snooker's different too. Like, you don't want to actually break the whole thing up here. Instead, you want to do something like that and bring the cue all the way back, which not into the pocket, please. Okay. Look at this dude. It's like a co a former coworker of mine. Okay, if I get that red ball, what color am I going for? Blue maybe? Okay, got the red. Right, cool hat. <laughs> Alright, yeah, let's get the blue. Nope, too, too much angle. It's, the snooker table's so big, it's like the tiniest adjustments will send the ball completely off course from where you're trying to aim it. It's that shot. Okay. I mean, you kind of just lined me up for this one, and I can maybe sink the black then. Uh, no, I don't have a good shot on the black. Maybe get the pink? Or the green? I don't really have any good shots, honestly. Let's try to see if I can get something on the pink here. Oh, nope, I hit a red. That's bad. Oh, well. Luckily, fouls just award points in this. It's not... I mean, it's bad, but it's not... They don't get to... Why are you aiming for the green? Oh, right, he can call a free ball on that, because of the way, way he was positioned. He didn't do anything with it. The, t the pockets are so small on a snooker table. Oh, well, oh. job sinking the black out of turn. Uh, you know, why don't you go ahead and play this again? Because you don't have any good shots. What is this music? Oh, it's Crystal Chronicles. Oh, <laughs> oh no. Touching the black. Final Fantasy VI yeah, does have an amazing soundtrack. I mean, I, I love all the classic Final Fantasies. Uh, six, uh, seven, eight, nine. All of those are good. Even four. Four's a little bit lighter on the soundtrack department, but it's still pretty solid. Uh, I don't really have any shots here, so we're gonna go... We're gonna try something here. We're gonna try to just lightly tap this red, and then hide the cue ball behind the blue. Not quite what I wanted, but 
shouldn't give him any shots. Or he'll just sink that. Okay, never mind. I was wrong. <laughs> oh, no. That's some good pointage for him. Nice shot. Wow, he's running away with this one. Well, those po he scored like 12 points on this turn. Yeah, that is that is pretty popular. Uh, isn't there another Final Fantasy character whose last name is Highwind? Or maybe I'm just thinking of Kane. Might get over there. Nope. I'm probably gonna lose this match. <laughs> wow, a nice shot. Sid Highwind and Advent Children. Uh, that might be what I'm thinking. Wait, Advent Children? That's just Final Fantasy VII, though. Did they really name him... Oh, speaking of... Oh, speaking of more uh, JRPGs, now we got Dragon Quest. There's a JRPG I've never actually played. Is the Dragon Quest games. Is that enough? Is that going to come back? Nope, not enough angle. <laughs> Right, it is the name of the airship in 7. Yep. Oh, and I was going to mention, too, my favorite Final Fantasy. I do like 4 and 6, but my favorite all time is probably 9. Um, 9 just speaks to me on so many levels. I love that game. What am I going to do with this? I really should play a Dragon Quest game, I think. I think I would enjoy it for multiple reasons. One... It's kind of classic JRPG stuff, which I do like some time to time. And also, the music's really good, and um, I really like Akira Toriyama's art. So, I'm a big fan of his art style. So, I really should try one of them one of these days. Might be good. Nope. Maybe. Nope. Yeah, I definitely feel like I'm outclassed on this match. Oh, well, I say that right as he uh, scratches, so. Let's see. I'd like to get that pink ball. I wonder if I can do something like. This. Oh, nope. I didn't want to hit the pink ball in there. I was trying to get the red in behind it and then be able to go for the pink, but oh well. Nine on Switch. See, that's the other problem with Dragon Quest, is I don't know where I'd want to start. Like, I don't know, like... I, I think they're, all, they're mostly independent of each other, but I think... But I, yeah, I just don't know which one would be a good one to start with. I almost picked up Dragon Quest XI at one point. Let's do this. Backspin on this. Oh, it didn't go in. I go down there. Okay, I'll take it. <laughs> good pointage. Need to play defensively here. 
That was a little bit too much on the Q. I had to hit that softer. Oh, is he going to scratch again? Almost. Still have no shots, really, so we're going to go... Yeah, just put it down there in that corner. Don't go in the... Oh, don't go in the pocket. Ah! break with the shots. Um, I didn't hit it. Okay, well, I'll hit that one, I guess. shots here though. Maybe the yellow. Ugh. Like I said, I'm not very good at snooker. It's a lot harder. <laughs> Thing happening down here. Pokemon Mystery Dungeon. There's another game I never played. Rolling cue ball. I can do something with this pink here. Uh, let's see. Let's put the right there. Oh, close. I feel like I may need to concede this game to, uh, what, 13 points behind? I mean, there's still 13 points on the board, so I can... Like, there's no need to concede yet, but... I really wanted to get that hit. <laughs> nah. Oh, he missed it. I was going to say it makes an easy shot for him, but... Okay, here's an easy shot on that red. And then, where are we going after that? I'd like to get the black. So if we do... It's not quite what I wanted. Do the green, though. Maybe. Let's see. Yeah, there we go. That was a good set of points. I'm gonna do something here. I'm not trying to sink this red. Instead, I'd like to. Oh, no. Cue ball didn't go where I wanted it to. I wanted to come back the other side. I should have spinned it on the one of the sides a bit more. And. Okay. 
That's one way to play that, I guess. Should be an easy shot. What do I want to go for next after that? Maybe the brown? Don't go in there. Okay. Brown I can't really get from here. Um, maybe green. No, too much. Much of an angle. Really no shot for me here. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna try to just bring the cue ball. Well, it didn't come back like I wanted it to. this red ball around for a little while here until one of us leads the other one a shot. Put that down on that side of the table. Again, that cue ball's not quite going where I want it to. The problem with it is that the, uh, the snooker uses a different type of cue, too, so the, the amount of pressure you put on the ball and amount of English Makes it, it's very different than, than with regular pool. That might be good right there. Oh, nope, that is not good. Mind. Well, that might give me a shot. Yeah, it does. Uh, so come back some more. Come back more. If that's enough. I wanted to get the black, but I might be able to. Yeah, there we go. Big points. That should put me in the lead, actually. Or tied. Tied, yep. Oh, I missed. <laughs> I wanted to hit the side of the yellow ball there, and I, I messed it up. Oh, you want me to reshoot that? Okay, I'll reshoot that. <laughs> okay, that's a pretty nice shot on the yellow you gave me. Green is next, I think, so... Oh, that's a terrible angle. Oh. Just get the, get the green on the other side of the, of the blue, maybe, here. Ah! Might be game. No. If I can get if I can get a couple more of these sunk and just run through the rest of the table here, I can still win. Oh nope, too far to the right. do with this? Oh wow, it actually worked. <laughs> I won't claim to be, to have been planning that one, but, oh no, too far to the left. Okay, shoot it directly into the hole.
Not too hard. I wanted some extra on that so I could get the cue ball back down here, but makes it harder to pocket it. All the way back. Oh, close. This is one of the closest snooker matches I've had in this game, and he's going to win it now. Oh, nope, he messed up that shot. I'm not going to try to sink this here. I'm just going to make it hard for him to. Possible. Get up against that rail. Okay. Truck time? Okay, yeah, that's perfect. That's about where I was thinking ending is after this game anyways. So, I will send a raid over there as soon as I finish this up. Oh. That's assuming this ends anytime soon. Neither of us can sink this damn black ball. No, no, you're fine. I, I was saying I was planning to do it anyways, so I appreciate the, the notice that it was coming up. Oh, that was close. Ah. If this was any other stream saying that, oh, you know, this stream is happening now, you know, like I could see why that would be considered bad form, but no, I was I was already saying that I was planning to move over there anyways, so you're good. I think this is the end of the game here, too. There we go. Alright, cool. No, you're good. You're good. Uh, let me... So that that's where we're going to end it tonight. Um, appreciate everybody who came in and uh, tuned in for both Ori and just chill uh, pool games at the end. Yeah, it was fun. I'm glad you guys enjoyed it. I... I always feel a little weird playing games like this on stream, because it's, like, so, like, I don't know, not interesting for most people, but, I don't know, it's chill and I enjoy playing it, so that's why I, that's what I do on stream. But yeah, well, I'm gonna go uh, throw a raid over uh, Sphinx's way, so thanks a lot, guys, for coming in. Exactly, conversation is nice. Yeah, I will see you guys over there.